Camera's out. We're tidying up the mess that you make here. Yeah. Um, the guy that um, the guy that came and illegally seized our stuff, here he is. His name's Paul Simpkins. Remember that. If anyone happens to know his home address, we need that as well. Jackie Smith's an inspector as well. Get all the recordings you like. Right? These people are public officials acting against the public interest. Get all the recordings you like. These are the same people who couldn't explain to us why they were stealing our property earlier. Location property. You took the work. Have yeah. you? Can we have? Can, I, can, I, we, I, can we have? Can we have the receipts for the property that you stole? Have you got the receipts of all the books? Have you got the names of all the books that you stole? Where? Can I have a look at that document? Hey, is it? <laughs> they walk. They walk. It's a collective, mate. Of individuals, mate. Is that a receipt? Is it? This is what this pig's given us as a receipt, right? This is what this pig calls a receipt. What does it say? The receipt people says 6 a.m. to 2 p.m. seven days. Council depot, corner of Bay Street and uh, Wentworth Park Road. Now, Clover Moore has stated categorically that the council were not going to support the police on this. Who can get hold of Clover Moore now? I'll get a hold of them, all right. Get hold of no, uh, Glenn. Does anyone have Glenn's number in their phone? Glenn, they've taken our stuff to a council depot. Can you ask Clover what she had to do with that clip? It's clear that this city has a real rubbish problem. I mean, you guys are taking all of our stuff and calling it rubbish. And we just found like more rubbish. All this rubbish seems to be collecting here. It's really weird. Hey. <laughs> I don't know we what we're going to do about the rubbish. So are we going to remove this? this? Are you going to? Uh, uh, I you think gonna it's gonna a work me? of art. It's it's a, I think you've got a better idea. I don't, I don't think it's a work of art. It's sitting well, in a little place. Place, isn't it? Actually, I'm a professional artist, and I made this, and it's an installation artwork. I'm going to go with the professional artist on. But well, I'm not going to pull it down, and I don't give a shit. Do any of you to pull down my artwork? You got something with your name on it? No, and I'm going home. We're actually committing an offence in Martin Place by actually camping or creating a. I, camping I don't think I am. How, how is she camping? Yeah. <laughs> I think more people find what you're doing offensive right now than anyone. The irony is we built this for you guys to destroy, so by destroying it, you're actually doing precisely what we did, wanted you to do. But if you want to be complicit in our alleged crime, then help yourself. Yeah, you know. It was not in the first! It's just a 
just a fan. Camping equipment because yeah. in this one yeah. you can you can fit at least ten really small children. Yeah, I, usually <laughs> fetuses, probably dead fetuses. I, you, you, pr you probably actually get some Asian students in there. Yeah. Like they'd rent that out. Yeah, you like, so probably yeah. get. Yeah. yeah, you probably would. Two hundred a week off. Oh, oh easy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Own stuff. Yeah. Mike check. Mike check. Mike check. Mike check. Mike check. Mike check. Police. Police. Will, Police. Will remove. Will, will remove. remove. Property, property that is not, that is is not individually, individually claim. Claim. Claim, 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 claim. If you, if you have, sleeping bags, have sleeping bags or other property, or other property, other property that is here, that is here. The, police the police want you, want you to, say to say that is mine. That is mine. mine. Then they'll let us keep it. Then they'll let us keep it. This is mine. 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 Matt, your boxes. for my sand which I'm going to go home and use for construction. Uh, yeah, with the camera. Yeah. What do you want to take? I want to probably dock it for my sand. Tell me where you got the bucket and the, the sand from. I got the bucket from the chuckout from the rubbish and I got the sand from the beach. It's my sand. Alright, I'll show you and what I'll we'll do. Of it. Yep. I'll get someone to write a receipt in the notebook. Thank you, you give us your address and we'll mail it out to you. Thank you. That's all you want? Yes, that's what I want. There you go. Alright. Get this gentleman's details. Yep. Get his bucket of sand. Yep. Get his details. We'll handwrite him a receipt and we'll mail him a copy out to his home. You got some ID driver's license? No. Need to use your No. Look, 
And what's going on here, people, is the police came early on today and took our cabinet. They took our cabinet, which kept this equipment safe and secure. And now... Do we have we invite you? Do we do we bring you here? You the you all want to have a go. You all want to have a go. You all want to have a go because you drove me shit. Boring. And the most exciting things happen in your life. Grandchildren will be so proud of you. In fact, officers, welcome to the new paradigm. Because if you want to pull these down, you'll be pulling them down all over the city. And if you're wondering why we're all shouting at you, because this is what powerless people do. The only legitimacy in what you are doing now is your force. The only legitimacy you have is your taser. The only legitimacy you have is your gun. The only legitimacy you have are your arms. But how do you feel? Uh, you, you've got long careers ahead of you. Yeah. Particularly when it's in police states. <laughs> this is where all of our dollars are going. And without doing actions like this, we don't get to see this. This is just implied. But when they come out and they actually go and arrest people and remove stuff, we see it. We see the force. We see what we're up against. You guys are on the wrong side. First you take books, then you take cash. Against the government. It's a problem, got. We're fighting the same enemy. <laughs> I'm a public servant. You guys are public servants. I'm a teacher. I'm here to help improve the community. You're police. You're here to protect the community. Together we can build a community where people are protected and educated. But instead, this is who you're protecting. I wish I could sing. I'd love to sing What a Wonderful World by Louis Armstrong. What are we going to do? If society never got to see this, it would always just be implied. It's always like, <laughs> watch out, don't step out of line, the boogeyman's going to get you. When, you. when you see what the boogeyman actually is, a line of police vans picking up cardboard from the street, you realise that there's so little, so little in our way. All we have to do is stand up together and voice our concerns. That's all we have to do.